This is the House of Horror, where members of a British family were killed and kidnapped by Hamas fighters. The bathroom's completely wrecked, glass everywhere. The tragic events took place last week here in the Beery Kibbutz, where more than 100 people were killed. Each of those little puffs of smoke is where one of the Iron Dome missiles successfully intercepted a rocket that was heading our way. Even now there's rockets coming over from Gaza and it's more than a week on from the horrors that unfolded right here on this very leafy street. It's almost too awful to contemplate but in many of these homes along here after the gun battles, people would be locking themselves away in their safe rooms, secure rooms. And the Hamas gunmen simply set fire to the house. Escaping from here was hell. These are the cars parked just outside the British family's house. The mother, Leanne from Bristol, was killed here in her home along with one of her daughters, Yahel, who was only 13 years old. This is an upturned barbecue in the front garden. Four bullets. That was breakfast or maybe last night's meal, not cleared away and now just chaos, panic. This looks like the panic room with its secure metal door. There are blood stains all over the floor. The bathroom's completely wrecked, glass everywhere. The father, Eli, is still missing, along with their oldest daughter, Noya, 16. They are believed to have been abducted by the Hamas militants and taken to Gaza. The family is clinging to the hope that they might still come home. As this family come to terms with this horror, Yahel's uncle, Sharon, says she was a lovely, sweet, interesting, helpful, funny girl who loved nothing more than to be around other people. 